Spectra are one of the most common materials you can get in Wayfinder. They are used to craft all different types of things inside the game. Throughout your adventure, you'll find all different types of spectra. In this guide, we will go over how to obtain all the different types of spectra so that you know exactly where to get them and how to farm them. Let's get started. First, we will start off with Burnet and Crag spectra. These can be obtained while traveling about the highlands. For Crag and Verdant Spectra, you'll want to hit the green crystals and defeat enemies in the lower skylight area all the way to the Ironstone Keep. Once you get to the outer Arlean area of the map, you'll find Glimmering Crag and Verdant Spectra. The Glimmering versions can be found from defeating enemies as well as hitting crystals and opening chests. The last thing I want to mention about Glimmering versions of Crag and Verdant Spectra is that they are used for quests, so you might want to stack up on these while you are out there. The final spectra type you can find in the highlands are dropped from the world boss Pyre. These spectra are known as Exalted Crag and Exalted Verdant. I don't suggest you fight Pyre alone, so you'll need to find some people to take him down to get the Exalted Spectra. Up next we have our tier 1 spectra. These crystals can be found in the following expeditions. Codex Halls, The Pit, and The Shrouded Woods. While running an expedition inside Codex Halls, you will have a chance to obtain Silver Spectra. While running an expedition in the pit, you'll have a chance to get the Blood Touch Spectra. And while running an expedition in the Shrouded Woods, you'll have a chance to get Deep Wood Spectra. While the Shrouded Woods drop Deep Wood Spectra, it is a Tier 3 expedition. What this means is you'll be able to farm Tier 3 Imbued Spectra while running Shrouded Woods, which will be covered later in this video. When you enter one of these expeditions with a certain imbuement, you'll have a chance to obtain different spectra depending on the imbuement you choose at the beginning of the expedition. For the Shadow Imbuement, you will get Shadow Warp Spectra. With Flora Imbuement, you'll receive Viridian Spectra. With Solar Imbuement, you'll receive Molten Spectra. And with Chaos Imbuement, you'll receive Unstable Spectra. Next on the list are the Tier 2 Spectra. The normal versions of these crystals are called Argent Spectra, Blood Warp Spectra, and Calcified Spectra. You can find the Argent Spectra in the Expedition Undercroft. To obtain Blood Warp Spectra, you'll need to do the Expedition Bloodworks. And to obtain Calcified Spectra, you'll need to run the Bone Orchard Expedition. While running a certain imbuement, you'll be able to receive Tier 2 Imbued Spectras. These spectra can be identified by the word Glimmering at the beginning. For example, Glimmering Shadow Warp Spectra would be the name of the Tier 2 Spectra you obtain while using a Shadow Imbuement. The imbuement used in the Expedition will drop the same type of spectra as it did from the Tier 1 Expeditions except now it will be a tier two or glimmering. Now onto the tier three spectra. These spectra are known as alloyed spectra, deep earth spectra, and hollow spectra. To obtain the alloyed spectra, you want to run the repository expedition. You can find the deep earth spectra inside the expedition Baldum, and the hollow spectra you can obtain from the expedition hollow heart. The imbued versions of tier three spectra are known as pristine. An example of a Tier 3 imbued Spectra would be Pristine Shadow Warp Spectra. Same as the last two tiers, you'll want to use specific imbuements to obtain specific imbued Spectra. Our last set of Spectra is known as Tier 4. As of right now, there are only Tier 4 Cragged, Verdant, and Imbued Spectra for this tier. Tier 4 Spectra can be identified by the word Exalted. For example, Exalted Crag Spectra would be a Tier 4 version of the Cragged Spectra. You can obtain Exalted Cragged and Verdant Spectra by fighting the World Boss Pyre, located in the Highlands. As of right now, this is the only place to obtain Exalted Cragged and Verdant Spectra. For the Imbued Tier 4 Spectra, the only location to obtain these is in the Expedition Hollow Heart. As per usual, you'll want to use specific imbuements in Expeditions to obtain specific imbued Spectra. Before I go, I want to give you guys a few quick farming tips. Number 1. While running these expeditions, remember the higher the sphere level you complete, the more materials you'll obtain. This includes spectra. Number two, there's an event in the mines called What Lies Beneath that can drop specific spectra after completing it, depending on the imbuement used. This event would be best used with floor imbuement to obtain viridian spectra because the floor imbuement in expeditions can be tough. Number three, loot goblins can drop spectra from different imbuements, so, Make sure to track these little buggers down when you see them. That's all I have for you today, Wayfinders. I hope this guide helped you understand how and where to find all the different types of spectra currently in the game. If you found this video helpful, 
please consider leaving a like on the video and subscribing to the channel for more Wayfinder tips, tricks, and guides.